Hey, welcome everyone. Today we're going to do some early game lab for season five of Standard Randomizer A World Tournament Cup or however you want to call it. And we have this seed, which is starting with Song of Time. What a perfect song to start with. And with uh, the Zora Sapphire. So the first thing I am thinking about, because we start as adult with Song of Time, is just that after the Dempe race, you can play Song of Time and go to Windmill. There's no really early use of this, but it still is, you know, it's it still is this. Okay, so let's go right into it and, uh, and see what happens on startup. Three, two, Juan, go. Okay, we're in Lake Hylia. Let's pause. What do we do? So, the thing is, we have time of day going right now. We cannot do any check of the Lake Hylia. It's... <laughs> yeah, I know, Kerox, we do cry. And I can basically go get the hint near the lab and then go to Hyrule Field and go for hiking. Is there anyone in chat that would go for back of lake hints right now? I don't think anyone goes for back of lake hints right now. It's just way too slow and you have a million other fast hints. So I think it's too slow. Is anyone of you guys skipping um, skipping the lab hint? I don't think anyone is skipping the lab hint. Are you guys skipping it? I don't think so. Are you? It's probably better than doing cuckoos on spawn. Wally, don't start. <laughs> we're not in CAG, okay? And we're adult. You either read all three or skip all three. Damn, Kirox, you're a, a very, um, how do you say that? Zero or one person. You would probably do both because you're slow. Okay, Gortho, if you're slow, then... Maybe don't take slow options, because slow plus slow is, is just going to be slower. Okay, I'm going for this hint. Uh, where can I set up a backwalk? Probably after this corner. And yeah, this looks good. Okay. Sacred Forest Meadow is past the bongo, so I can stop on the text box because when there's a text box on screen, then time of day does not pass. SFM is on the way to bongo. If you were playing a seed, do not, do not stop to write the hint when you know you're going to be hiking for half an hour right after. Okay, but that was just... Okay, can we get this? Okay, we saved it. <laughs> okay, I don't think I can get to CAC by day. You would fall down the water trying to write the hint. <laughs> I did. Okay, let's see. I don't think we can make CAC by day. So, I'm going to go... I'm going to go to the open grotto, and then what do we do? Do we go to Kag? Do we go to Lost Woods? Do we go Child? I don't think we go Child. DC is foolish. We open this, right? It's too early for not opening. We don't have money, we don't have shields, we don't have explosives. That's all of the things that we want from small chests. Containers would be all right-ish. So, yeah, I would open. You open too? You go open. Barca, you always... You would go Lost Woods first. That's true. I think I would go Lost Woods too. Kirox, you're saying straight to CAC would still be day? I think if we sh if we're sure that it would still be day straight to CAC would be nice. Salut Pitons, merci bonne année à toi aussi. 
Long time lurker, you open it all until you get bombs or choose. Um, I don't like thinking this way. I, I like, you know, taking decisions relative to the seed. I, this is one big advice that I would like to give is do not have always rules. Like, try to avoid um, taking decisions because you have this golden rule of always do this. It's it will just kill your decision making and adaptation. All right. Oh my god, we have Adrian J230X. So guys, if you don't know, that's a that's a machine that is uh, randomly pulling out some speech. Uh, I I will not read its message, but you are allowed to play with it. <laughs> It's allowed. Okay, and we know DC is Baron. DC Baron is huge, especially early on. So, uh, we still don't know. Do we go to Kek or do we go to Lost Woods? I am tempted to go to Kek and delay Lost Woods because cause no explosives and not too much but in the chat you guys would all go lost woods wally would go lost woods kira go lost woods barka you go lost woods too gortho you go straight to kak barka you're saying you can do river to pass time of day but it sucks in standard i mean river is not that bad in s5 early river is okay um as adults but i think it's it's very good at intermediary uh level i think in for like a top 64 the tournament plays it would be dangerous um, but it's not like insanely risky it's just it's just dangerous SFM way of bongo means high chance of nocturne, but not enough. That's true, Barka. I didn't see it like that. That's true. We should we should always watch the hints when we're trying to take a decision. And I think that is just the input that I needed to make my mind. You say make up your mind? Make up make up my mind and go to Lost Woods. Okay? Alright, let's go to Lost Woods. And I hope that it's going to still be day. And that we're going to be able to go with Nocturne. Okay, now guys, the thing is, I'm not going to be talking about anything interesting during this backwalk. Just so that I can cut it out during the editing. That's... That's the strat. Welcome back, Foxman. I don't think we could have made it to to Kak by day. All right, we're about to uh, reach Kokiri Forest, and it's barely still day. So I don't think we could have made it to Kak by day. So it was probably a good option to go for this. Yeah, you're right, Kirox. Maybe if you skip the lab hint, then uh, you can do it. What's up, Ecola? Ecola, you would just rush Kak, never Kokiri Forest. What do you mean? Okay, we open everything up and we just get the worst possible. <laughs> things out of all of them okay cool yeah but E. Cola, the thing is we have we have SFM way of the bongo so we're hoping to get nocturne ravage village mourns the sun song so I'm gonna take my sweet ass time And song. All right, to uh, to write down the hint. Okay, 
You need to leave for a bit, Barca. All right, I'll see you later. So in Lost Woods, let's be honest, there's not much to do. We're just going to jump over this guy and uh, go get the song. No, don't talk. Are my sound alerts on? They are. I need to practice this. There's no way I am not able to do that. Okay, I think I just need to reset the C up with the backflip and it's fine. All right, first hint, Zora's frogs, cool. Not super crazy, but all right. Bighorn has nothing. All right, so mostly nothing. <laughs> I don't know how else to do it than see a papyrant. All right, what do we get? Okay, so this is quite interesting. Let, let's talk about it a little bit. So we have Sacred Forest Meadow on the path to Bongo. And you could think like, oh, is ZL, it's important to be able to clear shadow. No, it cannot be uh, what is targeted by the hint. ZL cannot be the item targeted by the hint. So what we do know is that from the three checks that are in SFM, it is not this one. That's the only thing that we know. And then getting ZL before going to Cat Graveyard or before going Child is going to be quite strong. So when this is happening, and um, Ecola uh, just said before that uh, he would go CAC, it's true that CAC is really seductive. So you could think that getting this is actually like a potential racing advantage over your opponents. So in this case, uh, that's the kind of thing that could make you think, okay, I want to push this advantage uh, or not. Stuff like that. All right. So let's see how we can play around it in the next decisions. Let's go get this hint too. 40 is nothing. All right. So I'm just going to make my way out and uh, we are just going to go to CAC. Uh, Cac Piton, c'est le village Cacarico. T'as vu Philippe, ça va ou quoi? Okay, I don't think there is much else that I can do to go to Cac than going to Hyrulefield. You guys correct me if I'm wrong, but I think that's the only thing I can do, right? Once again, I'm not going to say anything interesting during this back walk, just so that we uh, we can talk about other stuff. Oh, shit. All right. 
We just got an interesting uh, thing going on in the chat. Kirox is saying there is the river option. So what Kirox is thinking about is um, is time of day. Right now, it's it's night. So if we go to Kek, what's up, Never Now? So if we go to Kek right now, um, Anju, the Kuko lady, will not be there. So we cannot get the Sphere Zero item from her. But if we go to River, we might be wasting enough time and be able to get to CAC by day. Come on, guys. When I'm explaining, you guys know I want to use that on YouTube. And so we would like to get to CAC by day so that we don't miss this. We also know that we're getting two songs. We're getting Windmill Song and Composer Grave Song. And both of them could be Sun Song that would solve our problem. But River is also something fairly interesting because um, we would get three hints. And then we're able to check one Sphere Zero check. And then the two other ones... Uh, they are locked by other stuff. Uh, as adult, we would need hover boots. And as child, we would need either a scale or a bomb bag uh, to get to there. Or a spawn that give access to that. Um, the, the thing that I do not like too much about river is that uh, we're going up to river and then we're just going down. And not much is happening. We don't have too many hearts, so we could potentially uh, play around a death warp, but it's not that much time save. So what do we do here? Guys, tell me in the chat, do you go to the river in order to fix the time of day? Do you go to CAC and hope for Sunsong? Do you go to CAC and just wait for a day? If you get a bottle in river, do you rush ice? I mean, rushing ice is not really an early game lab play. It's <laughs> early game lab. I really want it to be like something that we stay around kind of safe areas, but it's definitely a play. In 1v1, I would rush ice um, if I find a bottle in river. Because. The song in Ice Cavern, what you have to know is like, it's either a song that will unlock stuff to you, so it's positive and it could be mandatory, or let's imagine that it's a song that does not unlock anything, so it's mostly going to be a warp song, Then, and let's say everything that you found around there is nothing. Then what's going to happen is that the earliest you've been to Ice Cavern, the more time of the seed you will have to actually utilize that warp song to move around and optimize your routing so that you're basically slowly, slowly uh, paying back for the time loss of checking Ice Cavern. So Ice Cavern, you have to see it as something that the earliest you can do this play the less risk you're taking. And I, we're just imagining if we are out of logic. All right. What's up, Mefrochi? Okay, so do we go river or do we not do river? We do river. Okay, I like going to River because I think it's a really strong play uh, at intermediary uh, level of, of plays. But uh, uh, against really, really strong players, I think it would be very risky, especially with ZL so early because if you find a bottle somewhere else and you decide to go to Ice Cavern, you'll, you will have to. Uh, go up the river again, and that would be really bad. Okay, and I think this is why we get Kirox, Philip, and Nevernal saying river, and then Eko is saying Kak. But we're going to go river just uh, just for this one time. I think another play was to just go to Kak and wait for day at the entrance. 
because it's gonna be in like 25 seconds. But that's definitely an interesting choice. I think Cac is the optimal one and River is the safest one. So let's see if the RNG pays out. Okay, nothing on this check. Let's move on to the next one. Next check we're getting is Sphere Zero. That's very important to know because you don't need any items to get to it. So it's very important to know that this is Sphere Zero and this is one of the big strengths of River. Graveyard is on the path to Twin Rova. Let's write that down. And apparently we have a big chest. What if a bottle at River? We said uh, we said Ice Cavern would be uh, would be quite good. All right, what do we get? We just got baited. <laughs> it's okay. So just just nothing in here. We got one path though, Path Graveyard. Uh, which before going to graveyard is good. We don't know where the other hint of this is. 30 is a Deku stick. I think I got 42, right? So 30 and 40. But yeah, Peppy, uh, we, we've been talking about uh, how Ice Cavern is really good early game, but not late game. Okay, so no items in river. Uh, we get the hint that Skull Mask has light arrows, so it's something that we're going to have to route. We got that 30 is nothing, and we got a pass, so it's not it's not terrible hints. It's not incredibly good hints, but it's there, you know. Now let's just make our way fast to CAG so that we can reach there by day. Nevernal is asking, is Skullmas Light Arrows good info? I mean, we would likely get the hint at some point. And yeah, Light Arrows are super useless until the, the last fight. It's I mean, it's completely useless before last fight. So it's not super interesting. If it was Skullmask has a hook shot, then it's another topic. Alright, let's just do CAC normally. Iron boots here, okay. It's good for rushing ice. Big chest here, okay. Goron City Hammer unlocks a wallet. Uh, Forest Wind. Forest Wind is one of the strongest single items at making you faster, if not the absolute strongest. But right now, uh, that's not exactly what we're looking for to be set. We're more looking for explosives, a hook shot, a bow, uh, stuff like that uh, to get us started and like open really dense areas of, of plays. But okay. Getting some money. The money I'm getting right now, what I'm mostly thinking of using it for is going to be the scrubs in Lost Woods. And we get a hook shot here, so we're going to do the jump. OK, 
Okay. This isn't logic, so you want to be doing the jump if that happens. All right. So this was here. What's up, Ariose? Yeah, never now. This is Sphere Zero. Would have been great to go from SFM to River. Uh, having yeah, having the Iron Boots that would have been cool. I agree. So we can see right now that. The river play did not pay off. We got decent hints that we will get anyway late game. And what did we know? 40 is nothing and graveyard is important. Graveyard is super important no matter what. So, yeah, we will see. But for now, it was... We can see how it's not going to pay off for us that we've been doing river. That's... That's mostly the kind of, like, what I'm saying is that on volume, I think River has like 35% chances of being good, maybe 40, but it definitely means that you don't want to be playing it at top level. But it's, it's a safe option and it's less risky than playing like Valley Lake before Ranch and Lost Woods as Child or other stuff like that that are more safe. So it's definitely something to consider at intermediary level. And I like to do it sometimes. Okay, all of this time of day management for this piece of heart, we're so happy. Blue Ruby, I'm not taking it. It's not enough. Okay. Little tip. When you jump from a height and you're about to get the auto roll, uh, if you have the alignment for the back walk, then try to release the joystick before you land so that you don't get the roll and you can start your back walk immediately. It will save a couple of frames. The spawn, Philippe, was terrible. The spawn was in lake from domain. Terrible spawn. Okay, I think we agree that we opened this chest. We have 30 bucks in our wallet. Uh, we have no explosives, no shield. So we're opening this. Yeah, it's been a really happy hiking seat so far. Seria or Minuet and Child SFM, maybe? Maybe. So what you're saying, Ecola, is that it would give access to ZL? That's a good point. I did do KF Lost Woods yet, but as adult. What a bitch. Okay, another big chest. Oh, Dampe is a bro. Okay, a bow on a path graveyard and a scale on a path graveyard. This is all um, progressive items, so they are pretty difficult to keep track of. You're going to need to remember, like, is it locked by another scale? Or is it locked by another bow to determine which one is your path to Twin Rova? We will see. 
maybe we get an interesting song or maybe we get other items Nocturne after Dempe race to read the hint before getting the song. That's true. Yeah, I forgot It was probably best After the the cow freestanding to play Nocturne to get the to get the hint my bad That's that's a very good play Pierre top of fire has nothing. Okay, cool It's a trash hint, but it doesn't mean that the play is bad. The play is really good. You would have played Nocturne after getting the song? Mmm, that's true. That's a good time to do it. I never thought of it like that. Well, that's in the case that you have ZL, so... Yeah, really sharp thinking, Barca. Let's go. Okay, we're getting Song of Storms. What is the feeling around Song of Storms? Bottom of the well is open and is really good because we already have ZL and we can peek at all of the explosive chests. Rushing bottom of the well is not too bad. And I mean, this is on past graveyard. So we're probably getting something related to Twin Rova behind Song of Storms. And this also gets us to think that um, it was quite a bad play to do Adult River because River now has isolated Frogs 1 as child, which is going to suck. So yeah, not too happy about the River play so far. ZL is out of logic. Yeah, I agree with you, Ecola. ZL is out of logic, but this early in the seed, there's no way for us to know if it's really out of logic of the Sphere 1, because Sphere 0, as you said, could have a logical access to getting the Minuet song uh, as child. River was not a big gamble, but it was definitely a risk to take. It was not the best probabilities uh, that you were playing if you were playing River uh, this early into the seed. Uh, you were playing the lower odds for sure. It's, it's lower odds that come with a lot of info. And it also comes with a sphere zero check, so it's not completely garbo, but it's just not very good. I'm not forgetting anything. By the way, I didn't ask you guys, but everyone's going child right now. Archery? Fuck, where did I get a bow? Oh, yeah, 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 wait. We're doing archery. I forgot about bow. Yeah, I'm thinking about that. Gojeta told me yesterday that if he has bow, then he goes up DMT. I just find it super weak. Like, with just bow, it's so weak. My god. How many? 10? 
<laughs> Always choosing Keck. Uh, let me get nuts back. I mean, DC is barren. So I'm not even sure Philippe would do it. But that changes things. Because now... The loop, DMT, DMC, River. No, like DMT, Goron City, DMC. It's not that bad anymore. It's just not good either. Because once, like, this is going to end up at the top of DMT, nearby Big Goron. What are you gonna do to go back to child? Yeah, it's one song. If you go DMT, DMC, the time of day can be bad for Go Child. That's also true. Time of day can be bad. And we're just going to end up at the very end of the world. Um, if DC was not barren, then you think of it twice for sure. But with DC barren, I don't know what to think of that. I really don't. I just don't have enough warp songs to make it good. Do I? I mean, we could still play Nocturne and then go child, but I think the safe play right now is to just go child. So I am tempted to just go for the safe play and go child. Overextending uh, to out of logic plays because of choose seems a little iffy. I really enjoy having Choose as Child for Bottom of the Well and also for Lost Woods that we're going to go through. And then we can learn more about how ZL is locked because ZL was on Minuet and we don't have access to there already. So I, I would tend to think that going Child right now is the safe play and overextending to Adult is actually insanely risky. So, I'm sorry homies, but let's go, let's go child. Another thing that makes me want to do that is I have 12 rupees and no shield. I hope it's enough time of day to get to ranch by day <laughs> go take bolero and wrench <laughs> hopefully 50 we got this. Lost Woods Baronade. Zora Domain. 50. Zora Domain. Lost Woods on the path to Baronade. So, Lost Woods on the path to Baronade makes us want to use our choose there for sure. And then also makes us want to have rupees that we do not have. Uh, we'll see how that goes. All right, let's go read. Water Temple. Shadow Temple, Forest Medallion, okay. Spirit Temple, Fire Medallion. And then Deku Jabu Forest. So it's DC and fire as stones. Okay. AD not looking too good right now, not gonna lie. 
Yeah, Zora the main Baron was still Frog's one to check because Song of Storms is a path. Uh, you know. That's that's where Adult River, you know, hits hits back. All right, we're going to pick up this mask because uh, it unlocks light arrows, but we're not anywhere near rushing this quest. Now, it's twenty bucks to play, right? I don't have twenty bucks. So I can't play this minigame. So I go out. That sucks. The thing with Hyrule Castle is I don't think I have enough time of day. I think I will get fucked by time of day if I go there because it turned day when I was like in in the top grotto of river and then I went all the way to river, down to river, to Kak and then from Kak to market. So if climbing the vines it turns like it turns yellow then I can't get to ranch before night and that would suck so much. So what I'm hoping for right now is save warping after the ranch and actually getting something like a castle spawn or something like that. I don't even think I'm getting rupees cuz I'm I'm too afraid of night coming too soon. And it turns out I was too afraid for nothing. I still had time. Hey, what's up, Luna? Okay, my bad. I had more time of day than I thought, so I went a little bit too cautious. Now it's gonna suck for rupees. I definitely want to get rupees right now, and I am not getting them. How do I know about time of day? Well, Kaipi, it's just, it's mostly feeling, um... Night lasts for about one minute, and day is like a minute and 30 seconds. So it's just approximations, and as you saw, like, even with quite a bit of experience of time of day, I, I was wrong by quite a lot. So it's just, you know, at some point you develop a feeling of like, I can go from here to there, and it's going to spend the entire night cycle, and... So this distance is a little less or a little more. But for example, oh my god, Bolero is really in here. Uh what I was going to say. When you get out of Castle Town, um then well, out of market into Hyrule Field, you have to start back walking before it starts getting yellow. You know, like the, the sky and all of the colors starts going a little bit of yellow. Um, if you already have started the back walk to Lon Lon at this time, you should make it. 
Um, if it's already yellow before you started the back walk, you're likely getting fucked. Dioneru, merci pour le host. Merci beaucoup. Bienvenue à tous. On est en train de faire un early game lab et je le fais en anglais parce que c'est le genre de truc que je mets sur YouTube. Du coup, en fait, on réfléchit à toutes les décisions de routing qu'on va faire dans le rando euh, d'aujourd'hui. Merci beaucoup. C'est bien passé ta session ou quoi Ouais, ça, ça stratifie euh, sec, sec, sec. Du coup, il faut, faut que je repasse euh, rapido in English, mais euh, je suis sûr que vous déchirez tous l'anglais. Alright, so I'm just getting Bolero uh, at Malon. Bolero is really good because it justifies that we went child instead of overextending adult to DMT, and we're going to be able to... Uh, get to those places really fast with the warp song when we get back to the adult. Si win, si lose. Et du coup, t'es bien ou c'est moyen? T'es un top player, t'aurais dû faire 12 wins, non? Après, j'imagine qu'ils font un matchmaking. Euh. Alright, this is only 5 bucks. That's not much. What do you guys do? What's up gamers? A Y A Y A Y I got to get some bread, but I'll be back too too. Two, 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 oh two, my god, two, that's going to last two, forever, two, Skyward. Two, 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 Almost two, as long two, as the amount of time that you have two, been. Two. One of the slickest Asphalt Surfer Skyward for 25 months and only Juanro. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yes, bonne année, Neru. T'espères que je deviendrai le meilleur speedrunner 2022 Je vais pas te mentir, il euh, y a de la concurrence. Mais euh, je t'avoue que c'est un de mes goals de, de, de monter un peu euh, en grade euh, du speedrun, quoi. Ouais, 25, c'est beaucoup quand même, Skyward. Hein. On se rend pas trop compte, mais... Ok, so... Eco, you're saying equip you and save warp, so you're hoping to be around Lost Woods, Kokiri Forest, or stuff like that. What's up, little guy? Otherwise, we could be in market. If we're in market, we're kind of fucked. Uh, what we could do is spend nights in market. Nah, that would be terrible. If we're in market, we want to go out as fast as possible. Otherwise, we're locked in. Nah, we could get out with Nocturne. So it's not that bad, but it still is quite bad. But at least we would get some more money. We could get a Sphere Zero check with Kiki. And then... Uh, combo with Dampy Digging. All of this is quite bad. We would rather be in Lost Woods as fast as possible. That's kind of uh, the the idea that we want to be following right now. So, okay. We're going for the Say Warp of Luck. And let's see how this goes. Oh, more so, Leon. Dempe and the Well. That is very true. That is very true. We have Bottom of the Well to do in Kakariko. Uh, so it's not as bad as what I was saying. That's true. So we're really happy to be either in Lost Woods or in Kak. Let's see what happens. My god. <laughs> ah. <laughs> okay. So, it's a difficult... This is a really difficult choice. It's a really difficult choice. But I think... Yeah, it's it's like... It's almost cack in which you want to do bottom of the well... And it's also almost like it's it's almost lost woods because we have the scale, so we could go up river, and then use the scale to dive, and we would be in lost woods, and then I think CAC is really easily accessible with Nocturne, so we have to privilege uh, using the twenty seconds of the reset in order to go to Lost Woods. 
if you're cheating using emulator, then I think it's okay that like, yeah, you can go to CAC and then just, just reset 17 more times and not lose time. Um, but that's, that's another topic for another day. I'm kidding by the way. Um, so yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I think right now Frogs 1 into Lost Woods sounds pretty good. Do you guys agree? Is there something I'm missing here? It will use one chew, but I think that's that's okay. Uh, do we buy a bean? Like, we don't even have enough money to buy a bean, so let's just not. Uh, do we get 20 bucks on the way in order to have more money arriving in Lost Woods? Ha. Huh. Or do we just play another song to the frogs to get 50? I think another song to the frogs to get 50 sounds pretty good. Yeah, you can do frogs one and farm rupees on the frogs. That's true. Barca, when you say depending on time of day, what are you seeing with time of day? You're thinking about Dempe, right? Okay, I think we all agree. We go over there. Let's see what we get. Nothing. And then we get a song in order to get 50 bucks. Yeah, I did River as adult and it's it was a bad decision. It's not classic French strat. The situation made it okay. All right. <laughs> Don't bully me. Why am I taking this cuckoo? <laughs> All right, let's go. Tu aurais pu faire ZL pour aller plus vite à la place de Song of Time. Tu veux dire en termes de nombre de notes Non, je crois que c'est pareil. Hein. Ok, what's your routing here in Lost Woods I'm just curious. Just being curious. You go directly to the song. Or you go do checks first. Song first, song first. All right. Song, song, okay. I think, I think it's a good decision because we do not, like, we're missing especially one song that could help us clear a... Uh, Clear the lost woods. I'm still missing twenty bucks. Hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Epona on a path is be very careful. Be very careful. That's probably a rush GTG. So we have to be very careful about this. There was good chances that it would be Saria. I'm agreeing with you guys. So it was it was still good to do first. Epona is is rough because right now we don't really know how uh, we get the access to ZL. I think this is good because it's a path. Hey, thank you guys for the follows, I appreciate I probably won the stick. And I'm opening this for money. It's okay-ish. Hmm. Yeah, I had ZL and Minuet. Uh, so the way to read my tracker is... The big icon with ZL. Can you see my mouse on screen? No. The big icon with ZL means I have ZL. And then uh, the small, so that's ZL. And then there's a small icon here. The small icon means what was on the ZL check. So what was on the ZL check is the starting song. And the starting song was Song of Time. So if you go to the minuet stuff, you see I don't have minuet, and then you see there's a small ZL on it, which means I got ZL on minuet. That's that's the way to read my tracker. Also, I was missing money, so there's something I could have done which would have been smart, but I am a one head, uh, would have been to get those five rupees, then go into the grotto so that I could get them again uh, by by going here. So I'm going to choose to reload this because Lost Woods is also a path and I really want to be doing all of the the possible stuff right now and not wait for it. So I'm going to need 80. There's two scrubs that are going to ask me for 40. You think Bolero probably has forest access? Uh, so we're getting Bolero Sphere 0 in Lon Lon Ranch. And then you think playing Bolero gives you gives you a forest access. Makes sense. Okay. I'm uh, I'm buying it. The thing is DC and fire do not require ZL. So who knows, Forest Axis might be locked by the AD, so AD might be locking ZL. Who knows? Who knows? Um, Alright, we've done this song, I think Get Lost is a good option. Mm, one question, do you go to Kokiri's sword chest right now before the rest of Lost Woods or do you do the rest of Lost Woods first? I think it's a little too far to come back from and it will be more viable to use a song to get out of there than to use a song to get out of whatever we will be in with Lost Woods. So let's just go and complete Lost Woods first and then we can we can take care of the rest. Uh, in order to do Lost Woods, I think... The routing is this. I 
I agree, Barca. Having Sunsong would ch would change that decision for sure. And it would also change the decision about money because we could have gotten money on the way to Kokiri Sword Chest. Uh, would have been a really good routing, like really smart. Okay, one more heart. I'm going to grab some money here. I really enjoy those five bucks. I mean, six. Yeah, Mido is done. Maybe do scrubs first. If Ocarina minigame gives you rupees? I'm not understanding that. Uh, it's a Goron Tunic. Okay, so we're getting a Goron Tunic on the path to Baronate. Wait, there was a wallet somewhere else. Goron City Hammer Chest has a wallet. So that's quite important. So I don't think that's going to be the path. I don't think so. Unless you are supposed to climb up Fire Temple without having a hammer. So it could be immense information if it's the tunic, or it could be that it's not the tunic. And the highest probability is that it's not the tunic. What was this? Those such call stuff. Is that what it is? You guys uh, correct me about logic, please. Uh, anyone going Child Girl City? I'm not. That's too many choose. And I really want to clear Lost Woods and then go to bottom of the well. I don't think I have time to worry about that. And I can't even full clear. It's how many choose is gonna be? It's gonna be one, two, three. That's three choose. I think that's too much. And no sorry yet to full clear. That's true. Okay, so I'm going to choose to skip that, but be aware that it could be a play. It's just that it's not going to let you with that many choose left. Uh, but it could be a play of like, if you finish... Uh, if you finish Lost Woods and you don't have Nocturne, uh, then you could go to CAC with this way, which would help you clear DMT too. We could have safe scum this, but who cares? Oh, that's very true. We will be get back to give Skull Mask anyway, so we can skip Gorn City. I had not thought about that, but that is very true. So we can skip quietly Goron City right now. Uh, we will also be back when we get Zarya's at some point. So right now, I think our play is going to be... Um, just swiftly play Nocturne and then go into bottom of the well and stuff like that. Is that correct? No, that's not correct. We have Kokiri Sword Chest. Yeah, I am forgetting Kokiri Sword Chest. Sorry, my bad, guys. So it's Kokiri Sword Chest, then Nocturne. Um, there's an interesting play that we could be doing after Kokiri Sword uh, Chest, which is even a better play on on emulator because they they you know they obviously cheat. Um, is Okay, I don't think we are on the good time of day for Dempe right now. So what we could do 
is get to the overworld. Wait, we don't have Sunsong. I'm an idiot. Okay, just just scratch that. <laughs> it's a shit play. I was thinking reset, play Sunsong to put it to Dampe, and then go Nocturne, but yeah, fuck it. Ten minute head starts. <laughs> I don't know if ten minutes is good. Okay, now we would be playing Nocturne. And going to graveyard. Is Dempe there? Nah, he's not. Okay, we have crossed the one hour mark, so this is going to be it for the gameplay part of it. Now, let's go and check. Uh, let's go and check the spoiler log real quick. Uh, check the spoiler log. So, recent seed, spoiler logarino, raw spoiler. Hello YouTube without chat on screen. I think there's a way to download chat. I might I might look into that at some point. Uh Oh, an interesting thing would have been, do you go into Composer Grave to do Flame Storage? Would you full clear this path with getting Storm's Bow and Scale? Graveyard Flame is an option with Graveyard Path, that's true, okay, I was just, I was just saying that. Hmm. I think it would be interesting somehow. All right. So, how's this looking? Good. All right. So here are the hints again, and here's the spoiler logarino. Let's try to make it look good. I think the spoiler log is more fun when we go this way. So let's go to graveyard and check what was in composer's grave. Where's graveyard? Graveyard should be in overworld. So it's over here. Royal family tom chest. It was nothing. Okay. So it was really scale and bow and storms. All right. Then we would have gone to bottom of the huel. What has bottom of the well? Bottom of the well has a bottle for ice cavern potentially and mirror shield on lens of truth chest, which means it's not key locked, it's just locked by ZL, so it's in logic to get this mirror shield uh, without having explosives yet. No explosives in bottom of the well feels pretty bad. Am I missing anything? I don't think I'm missing too much. It can definitely be the path. Like, storms could be explained to be the graveyard path of Twin Rova because of this mirror shield. That's very true, Marcelio. 
So, yeah. And then I don't exactly know what was our next option. Yeah, ZL is still out of logic in this case. Let's go and check what was Sheik and Kratir. Sheik and Kratir was Requiem. Okay, okay, what is Requiem? Requiem is Prelude. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What's AD? AD is Minuet? Where is Saria? Saria is in Ice Cavern? Where is Rudo's letter? <laughs> That's a hell seed. What did we do? <laughs> it depends where ZL is. Don't panic. Don't panic. Maybe ZL is just in a, in a normal ass spot and we're saved. Target in the woods? <laughs> Where is the the slingshot? No, go up. Forest temple basement chest. I can't do that. Zora's fountain iceberg freestanding. Fuck. Hyrule Field Deku Scrub Grotto? Where? <laughs> My god! Where's a bomb bag? Bomb bag 20 skulls. Okay, okay, okay. So, bomb bag 20 skulls. Then. <laughs> then get the slingshot of Hyrule Field. Then get Rudo's letter. Then go to Ice Cavern to get your access to. No, you can't go to Ice Cavern to get your access to ZL. What are we saying? <laughs> what are we saying? This is evil. It is AD, no matter what. <laughs> do not play this seed. Okay, do not play this seed. It's funny how, like, lo logical AD was just defeated by Mido Skip. Okay. Now let's check a little bit of uh, where were the other items. Uh, iron Boots or Man on Roof. Uh, we get a hook shot there. Nocturne, we had it. Epona. Requiem is in Kratir. Uh, yeah, that we could have got with the hook shot. Oh my god. Water temple compass chest has the megaton hammer. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Then what else? Fire Temple, Bosky Chest has Kokiri Swords, so it's all- <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Without ZL. Hmm. <laughs> sure. That's quite a seed. Cool. Gerudo Training Ground. Okay, so GTG has Boomerang and Dints. That's cool. So that's probably the Epona path to Bongo. So that's good. Deku has a strength. Deku has first strength? Damn. Yeah, look. The... <laughs> The song from Ocarina of Time is before Sheik and Forest, so yeah, this this just confirms. Hyrule Castle Great Fairy Reward is a progressive strength upgrade? Damn. Okay, so there's another strength there. Oh, GTG has two more things. Hover Boots and Progressive Hookshot. Okay, GTG is just completely full of everything. Bottom of the well, Lance of Truth, check, Mirror Shield. 
Ice Cavern Compass Chest has the only magic meter. What the fuck? Ice Cavern early was really good. All right. I think that concludes it for this early game lab. Um, I hope you enjoyed the content. Thank you so much. And uh, see you in the next episode that I will record in five minutes. Ciao, ciao.